My name is Nicola Mason. I'm an associate professor at the University of Pennsylvania's School of Veterinary Medicine. I run a translational research laboratory which focuses on cancer immunotherapies and our patient population are mostly dogs. Hi, big man. How are you? He was diagnosed with a very aggressive bone cancer called osteosarcoma. It was devastating. The outlook was pretty bleak at that time. The course of action is amputation and then follow-up chemotherapy. And even with that, the survival times are about a year. The problem is the cells that have already peeled off the tumor and are hiding somewhere. And the idea of this new immunotherapy is to educate the patient's immune system to actually go and find those tumor cells and then specifically eliminate them. It's breakthrough stuff that we're doing here. I don't, there's not very many labs that are doing this kind of thing. So we're seeing them live out much longer than expected. Dexter coming up now to five years out with no evidence of metastatic disease. And that is half of his lifetime. You did it. Osteosarcoma in dogs is almost identical to the cancer in children in every way. With these very positive results we're seeing in the dog, we might be able to translate that over into children, and that would be incredibly important. We can learn from each other, and if we do learn from each other, we can move forward faster in both human and veterinary medicine. We're five years out now, and things look really very good. Thank you.